So the first step is you should locate your battery's positive side and the negative side, the ground side, and the red one to the neck to the positive, and the black one to the negative. There's no need to worry. So once you plug it that, it will be turned on, and here's the device looking for the software. So first you have a check. You can do a quick test for your vehicles. So this is about 80 amps. And you have a result like the SOH, a status of a house. So you can also test it when it's in vehicles. So you can do a battery test, check the surface ground, and you can also check the cranking temp, cranking test. So about when check the cranking test, you need to start the engine. After that, you see the engine is testing and you have a result about the cam and the cranking is normal. And you can also do the charging test. When you do the charging test, you see the ripple test is here. I would say increase the RPM to 2500 for 10 seconds. After you increase the RPM, you can test the charging test. So you can see the charging is a little bit high, and we have a loaded value and the unloaded value and the ripple. And also you can do a battery test. It's a regular product, CCA, which is about 800. Measure the status of health, also measure the status of charge. Okay.